Hello, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to speak about the success of Jamaican athletes in the women's 400 4 by 100 meter relay at major world championships which include world championships and Olympic Games. Stay tuned. It all started in 1991 when Jamaica won their first 4x100 meter relay gold medal which that team included Merlin Atty who ran on the final leg, the anchor leg and a blistering leg to capture gold. Take a look. Australia, France, Germany, Nigeria, Jamaica, Soviet Union, Italy, and Cuba. The women's four by 100 meter sprint relay. And of course, everything can go wrong if you get the changeovers messed up. The United States found that out in the semis when they went out, dropping the pattern. Grit Breuer on the lead-off leg, going well. So too are the Jamaicans there. Breuer didn't make up too much ground. The handovers are all good and this is Katrine Kraber and Katrine Kraber is already running a storm as she's gone right past the Nigerians she's up for the Jamaicans as well that is not the greatest handover but it's okay Sabina Richter Germany in the lead going well the Soviet Union and Jamaica with Merlin Otti on the last leg Germany have it not a great handover it's almost the bad one terrible handover from the Germans and they're in a bit of trouble Heike Drexler on this side Rivalba and Merlin Otti can storm it through to give Jamaica the goal and the Germans who messed up the last changeover terribly hope you get the bronze medal. In 2004, at the Athens Olympic Games, Jamaica captured the first 4x100m relay gold medal. A team of Tina Lawrence, Sharon Simpson, Aileen Bailey and Veronica Kemp Brown. Take a look. Let's这一项目应该是以杨百加队和美国队之间的竞争美国队他们派出了一支非常强的接力队而且为这次比赛他们也做好了充分的准备进行了很长时间的训练马良琼斯呢就是专门锻炼接力而杨百加队他们稍微接
凯尔特尔是二百米的冠军，他在这个项目上确实很具实力，因为他们接棒之后领先的优势非常明显。接力的比赛就是这样，即使实力再强，技术技术的环节上出现问题，也很难获得好的成绩，因为这是四个人相互配合的比赛。By winning the women's 4 by 100 meter relay, they also went on to win in 2013. That team includes Shelly and Fraser Price. Take a look. Then we have France, who were fourth in uh, Daegu two years ago. They have Celine Distel Bonnet, Aya Daly, Equesan, Miriam Sumare, and Stella Akakpo. The United States of America, Jenna Batamo, Alex Anderson, English Gardner, and Octavius Freeman. So a totally different team than that which won the gold medal two years ago. And they've not got Carmelita Jetta, who uh, ran third, of course, in the individual. So Jamaica may be favorites with Carrie Russell, Karen Stewart, second, first, and second again in the last editions of this event. Shelley Calvert and the double sprint champion Shelley Ann Fraser Price. Canada have Crystal Emanuel, Kimberly Hyacinth, Shayan Davis, and Kamika Bingham. And then look out for the Brazilian team on the outside who set a South American record in the heat to qualify 42 29. Evelyn Dos Santos, then Ana Claudia Silva, Franciela Krasuki, and Van de Gomes, the last three who all ran in Daegu two years ago. So it's Germany, Russia, Great Britain, France, United States, Jamaica, Canada, and Brazil for the final of the women's 4x400 relay. US have won six times in the past. Jamaica and Germany both twice. France once. Can Shelley and Fraser Price, waiting on the last leg, complete a treble here? Belkina leads off for Russia. The usual crowd roar before the start of any event. And I'll be reminded to go quiet when the start is ready, which he is now. And you're the well, there's still some idiot making a noise with the horn. They're off in the 4x1 for women. Tamo for the USA in lane 5 with Carrie Russell for Jamaica outside her. Russell certainly has gone very well indeed for Jamaica and hands over ahead of the USA. Running down the back straight, it's Anderson for the US and Stewart, the most experienced runner for Jamaica. Those two teams looking outstanding at this point. Oh, there's a problem for the US. They've messed it up and it's leaving Jamaica well clear. Calvert will hand on to Shelly Ann Fraser Price on the last leg for Jamaica. Well clear of the rest of the field. Here is one of the heroines of these championships in Moscow. Shelly Ann Fraser Price going to complete the treble. Wins by a streak. It's frantic behind. And it's France just dipping ahead of USA. I'm not sure if the USA will stay because there was a big problem early on. But what a huge margin of victory. What a triumph. What a time, too, at 41.29 for the Jamaicans. That's a national record. Only the USA have ever run faster. What a terrible change from the, from the Americans over in the back straight there. Disastrous. They really did mess it up. And I think that really cost them a, a medal because in the end, they were coming so fast. Well, there's the time. 50, sorry, 41.29, the championship record. But I'm not surprised the Jamaicans really are flying. And with this woman on the anchor leg, what do you expect? Well, she's laid down the gauntlet to bolt. She's done the treble. His turn will come in a few minutes' time. But so often we've seen wonderfully quick times unravel because the changeovers haven't been good enough. 
and what a finish by the French. They were coming through really, really fast on that ankle leg. Great Britain were in the hunt with a medal on that ankle leg, but the French woman came through brilliantly. Well, she did, but the US did even better, actually, to come back into contention yeah, exactly. and, and get a medal in third place behind the French athlete. Well, if you watch, though, it was that third changeover between Anson and Gardner over the back straight. If we can get another look at that, it was absolutely appalling. They stopped, they started. Here we go, look at this. This is Gardner, she stopped, look. And looking back, and then maybe, I don't know, it was pretty close to whether she got it inside the box. And also, have a look at the American change over here. She's just in the back of shots. But she's behind the French athlete here, you see, and she really does narrow the gap. British, British was second at this point and really left behind. Well, I think the Americans might, be, might, might have to have a good look at that uh, third ch uh, second change over the back straight. Well, yeah, and, and you can tell by their body language that they look a little bit concerned that there may be a disqualification coming. She did have the baton in her hand when she crossed the line, but that changeover from two to three was dreadful. Fantastic run for the Jamaican team. Absolutely smashed the Central American record. Shelly Ann Fraser Price takes the uh, trouble here. So from the start, Carrie Russell ran the first leg for Jamaica. And for the US, we've got Tamo here. But uh, this is already a Jamaican lead. There's the baton change from Russell to Karen Stewart. So experienced, she's winning a medal for the fourth successive time. Well, Karen Stewart running a good leg here. But you can see she slows down, and look, the American gardener stops before she gets the baton, and I think she knew she was running out of a lane and she had to stop. So now we have uh, Calvert to Fraser Price on the fast leg, on the last leg, but yeah, we look again at the Americans. And, uh, they lost so much ground doing that. Well, not so much ground, I'm not sure whether the officials are looking at that. Oh, well, we'll see for that. Time and time again to see whether they actually went outside their, um, their box over that far side. This is a huge margin, though, isn't it? Absolutely wonderful, Jamaica going clear. And actually, I just noticed on the outside, the Brazilians were going well, but they failed to make the transition from three to four and were definitely in with a hunt for one of the minor medals as they came sweeping round that bend. So there was drama everywhere there. Well, Tavius Freeman, as you said, and there's the big man looking on. He can't believe it. I think he's saying, go on, go on, go on. <laughs> and they've got it. But the Americans in the background, they're not too happy, look, are they? No, uh, worrying times. It's still standing at the moment, but, um, yeah, they'll be looking closely at that. Well, the gauntlet has been laid down by the, core, the female quartet from Jamaica. It's up to Bolt and the rest to raise the bar for the very last track event. Great Britain in fourth place, so we wait to see whether the Americans do stand in third place. The result still hasn't uh, come well, this up is on some, our board. This Rob will be, give us a better angle here, what's going on. You can see now Anderson had a great leg down the back straight. But English Gardner, look. She stops, starts this, this. Well, there's the box. She may have just grabbed it in time, but it is going to be very, very close under scrutiny. That is so, so tight. Watch the Brazilians on the near side going really well and then dropping the baton. Fraser Price has been the woman of the championships, arguably, hasn't she? Massive winning margin in the one and the two, and with the Americans not up there with them, she had the whole track to herself over the last 30 or 40 meters. Very last event is not too far away. Good running by the Netherlands in the semi-final with the likes of Chirande Martina getting them through. Justin Gatlin and the rest of his team they had a fairly shaky uh, transition yeah. from three to four, so they'll need to improve on that if they're to get anywhere close Here we go to again. the Jamaicans. They're watching it again and again just to make sure that she was in that box. In 2015, Jamaica defended their title with the team which also include Shelley and Fraser Price and Veronica Campbell Brown. They also win again in 2019. Take a look and enjoy. Veronica Campbell-Brown 
Natasha Morrison, Len Thompson, and Shelly Ann Fraser Price. The United States, English Gardner, Alison Felix, Jenna Prandini, Jasmine Todd. Alice Felix, who's twice before been a world champion at this event. Trinidad Tobago, Baptiste, Bay, Thomas, and Hackett. And the German team, Rebecca Hasler, Alexandra Burkhardt, Gina Lukenkemper, and Ferena Seiler. Now for Russia, Marina Pantelieva, Sina Risova, Elizaveta Demirova, and Anna Kukushkina. She fell the pleading off for Britain, then to Dina Russia Smith. Away they go, England. English Gardner leading off from the States. And the Jamaicans with Campbell Brown. Campbell Brown's run a storming leg, so too is Asher Philip for Great Britain. Here comes the handovers. Are they okay? You have to make a flying. And so too the US. Alison Felix running from the US. Can she make ground? No, it's Jamaica with Morrison. who will hand over to Thompson. Jamaica have got a good lead here. Alison Felix holds her. Hands over now to Prandini. Jamaica in the USA. Britain running well as well. And here we come into the finishing straight now. And she's got the baton. It's Shelly Ann Fraser Price. With Jasmine Todd for the USA. It's Jamaica all the way. Jamaica first across the line. USA in second place. Trinidad and Tobago finished third. Great Britain are fourth. And I think the Netherlands ahead of Germany. That I think is the one, two, three, four, five, six. Well, here is that uh, relay again. Just look out for these changeovers. Immaculate by the top teams. Just look at Morrison going away, even from Felix in those long white socks. Beautifully slick handover, too, by the Jamaicans. A bit of a problem for the Dutch there, and that enables the British to come past them, but way out front. 41.07 officially, United States 41.68 in second. The margin was huge, and Shelly Ann Fraser Price. Well, Daphne Shippers, her Dutch team finished in fifth, 42.33 seconds. And the goal goes to Jamaica. We will see shortly whether their men will follow suit, but that, Steve Ovet said, bettered. US of A, but tonight the Stars and Stripes pick up the silver and the championship record for Jamaica. Jamaica, the second fastest nation with 41.07 seconds. USA third from the outside, but watch for Jamaica third from the inside, and it's a brilliant bend by White, the Jamaican. She's already up onto Hackett, of Trinidad and Tobago. Smooth exchange down the back straight. Shelly Ann Fraser Price against Dina Asher Smith. The Jamaican beginning to close just a touch, but the Americans still in it. Three good changeovers. Now Jamaica coming through with Janelle Smith, and the Jamaicans have a slight edge. Great Britain in third. USA in second, and the Jamaicans are coming away here. What a run! Brilliant finish here by the Britons. It's Jamaica's gold, Great Britain second, and the United States this time have to settle for third. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Just remember to subscribe, hit that notification bell, like, share, and comment. Show out.